Hey guys, welcome to your next tutorial. Today we're just going to be installing the GLM library. Uh, now GLM stands for uh, OpenGL Mathematics. It's a really, really helpful math library. I'll put a link in the description for this library. Uh, it's a header-only library, so it's really, really easy to install. We don't even have to link any libraries. We just include the files. Uh, what it includes for us is it has a bunch of vector operations, matrix math, all sorts of things that are going to be really, really helpful so that we don't have to program all this ourselves. And it's going to be particularly helpful when we do camera transformation because we will need uh, matrices for that. Uh, so let's go ahead and to download it, we're going to go to downloads. Pretty simple, just grab the most recent one, uh, just grab the zip file, you know, it'll take you through uh, the SourceForge thing. I already downloaded it, so I'll go ahead and uh, pull it up. So I extracted it to my desktop, and uh, when you open it up, you'll see there's a GLM folder, and then in there you have a bunch of other folders. So this GLM folder inside the GLM folder, that's what we want. This has the entire library. You'll see a bunch of HPP files. These are all of the uh, files that you need for GLM. So let's go ahead and include this in our project. What we need to do is let's go to our project directory. Uh, let's see, projects, graphics, tutorials and depths we're going to go here and then we're going to go into the include and all we have to do is since both of our uh, projects are uh, already linking to this include folder we can just grab this internal glm uh, folder here and just drag it over and copy it in there so now uh, we are good to go that's all we had to do to install it uh, so we can now use it in our games uh, if you have any issues let me know let me uh, go ahead and pull up graphics tutorials so we can make sure it does indeed work uh, this is going to be a very short tutorial uh, let's go to uh, main.cpp and let's just see if we can include include and we're going to say um, glm there it is slash uh, glm.hpp that's the main file like that and now we have glm so that works uh, see you in the next tutorial guys